The second way is dealing with invoice, register, and approval. I'm going to go to the invoice register and I create a brand new one, invoice register demo. I go to the lines. Unlike the previous journal, you don't even have a vendor type or journal type. You must use the vendor. So if I pick and choose the vendor of my choice, like happens to be the guide to learn, I tab over again, invoice date, we discussed it. You have a capability to specify the invoice number. Pay attention if I use the same invoice number as I used before, it's going to cause trouble. I intentionally do that for you to see. And this time I'm going to put 50. And there is no offset account whatsoever. You could link it to a purchase order, but you don't have to. It's not part of our discussion at this moment. But pay attention if I validate this, it's going to cause a couple of issues. First of all, this is a registration. Somebody has to approve it. Therefore, you have to have the approved by a specific employee. That's the first error that you have to fix. The approved by requires you to have an employee or contractor or both. One of the things that you need to consider, somebody else who has a different skills in your team should go to the HR, properly define a job, define a position and create an employee. So in other words, you have to have a job, each job has multiple positions, and each worker could be a contractor or an employee and must be assigned to a position perhaps. We don't want to necessarily talk about HR right here. i rather show you things that can be done right within here. I can right click, go to the view detail. It's going to open up the worker form for me. Click new, create a brand new worker, like my name. This would be my last name. I can be an employee or a contractor. It's completely up to you. So let's say I'm a contractor. Alternatively, you could assign a position, but you don't have to. Starting my employee, when I'm going to end my contract work, maybe you're going to end it later on. Maybe by the end of November, I'm going to be done contracting and consulting this company. And I hire myself here. Now, as you notice, this gives you this specific weird error message. This is a bug. Ignore it, please. Why? If I close this and open this up, you're okay. 